What's up YouTube? It's Travis. We're gonna do some fret leveling here. I already started a little bit so you can kinda get a generalization. They were all marked with a uh, marker. Go back and forth and crisscross patterns over your frets. The file removes a lot of material at once, so be careful. This isn't technically the right tool to be using for this. But you know how renegade we are. We're renegades. I should probably tape off my cavity here. Swing a bunch of dust in my pickup here. And you can see the bottom fret is uh, low. The other ones are chroming right up. Go with the freight radius of the fretboard. But um, you can see it. It's green right there. That means it's low. Bring the other ones down to it. The blade of a file only goes in one direction. I've seen a million people using a file going backwards like they're cutting something. Let's get real people. The blades only go in one direction. I'm using a smaller file because we're down low. Use some sandpaper too. Lower the fret next to the one that's low. Keep taking your uh, filing marks out. As you go along, you don't want real deep ones in there. Don't do all your work with the bastard file. Okay, and then check me out. I'm sanding down the one that's even a little bit low. Just so we could start the process over again here. Yeah, mark it. And then once again, use your file to identify your highs and lows. Now you can see I still have a green area here. <laughs> Take your time with this. I'm just doing this for YouTube uh, kind of rapidly. Okay, we're there. We are there. So now you can see the green has left a, a little bit. You know, there's a little bit green, but these are chrome. And this is getting to the level that these are at. So we still have some deep grooves and uh, go back at it again.
Okay, we're starting to run a little too long here. Uh, now that we did it a third time, I probably would have done this third time when I did the whole entire fretboard, but I just kind of want to show you guys. Go over it the third time, the lightest. Don't start doing material removal here, okay? This is a, a visual guide. But still, I, I still have some green there, and I got to get at it. Mm -hmm. Things don't always go as planned, you know. Do it slow. Don't do any step rapidly. Look at what you took off before you start just being like, oh, I need to take some more off. No, you don't. You need to have the file tell you what to take off. And now we have an evenly wearing surface here. Okay. Hit it with the sandpaper one more time when you did them all and do that through the whole fretboard and take all day, go ahead. <laughs> 